Hey guys, and welcome back to Everyone's Prophecy. Yesterday we left off in Kandar. Kandar? I think it was Kandar. We did several side quests, and now we're continuing the story. Kandar. Okay. Let's lower the volume a bit. So, Dwarf Mines is to the right. Up is Apple or 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 Orchard? How do you even pronounce that? Or or Yard? Orc is hard. Okay. And Glenwell is to the left. And what is down here? This that's an enemy. Um, Kandar Dock is to the left, Mule Express is to the north. Okay. If only the game had a map. <coughs> you seven a seven an ass. I don't remember that enemy. <laughs> okay, so uh, uh black bleach tooth Desert, Witchwood Swamp, and the Duty Shrine. Ugh. Reach to Desert. I believe there's a side quest there as well. Witchwood Swamp is full of poisonous shit. <laughs> and is also the spot where we will get the Witch class. The first ever, ever class change in the game. And Duty Shrine is where we need to go. Okay. Let's go to the desert first. Because I remember that we have a side quest there. Kandar is good because it like they said it is the middle of the map, so the world I mean. So, you travel for several hours. Eventually, the grassy hills are replaced by desert dunes. Good thing there is no insta-kill here. Unlike in Avion, <coughs> looking at you, uh, Siren Cave. Are you an enemy? No. I said, Hierogriff. I'm half girl and half unicorn. I can turn into all sorts of animals. Really? Really? I am pretty sure this is one of the places you can get a shapeshift ability for, for one of the characters. Tinctures, tonics, salves. Aquifolium. Restores 100% HP. Marsh tea cures poison. We have 18 left of it. Tinctura Hypericum. Treats paralysis. Jar bomb. Oh boy. Limbark Traveling Circus. Have you seen our newest edition? The Talking Toad. Rebot. This frog can talk. I mean, basically, it, 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 it can't. It's, it's just a false thingy. There is a skeleton somewhere here. There. Help me! Please tell me I'm crazy. Is that really a talking skeleton? Please help! How can we help you, uh, sir? Take me home! Home, sir? Tarvedron! I'll show you treasure for your time. Take the bone. You take the skeleton with you. Yes, this is basically a side quest to go to the desert city with this uh, skeleton dude. I love how the desert is basically a big beach also. <laughs> Reminds me of Desert Beach from Trickster Online. 
Interesting. I remember there was more here. I guess I'm confusing this desert section with Tar Vedron. I'm pretty sure one of these will... Um, give me a transformation for Frederick later. Not sure anymore. Sand drifts and eventually replaced by grassy hills. <laughs> I could kill these, but I don't want to risk anything. Okay. Duty Shrine. I don't think I want to go that way just yet. I don't remember which way is Tar Vedron though. So, Glenwell is to the left. Dwarf lines to the right. Wait, dwarf. Is this telling me that the dwarf mine that I came through, or the dwarf mine where I can go and get another class change? Apple, an apple or orchid. Um, I think I'm gonna go to Glenwell first. Just, 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 just because. You son of an ass. I knew it. Holy fuck. And she's supposed to have the best defense right now. You travel several hours into the snowy north. Ah, Glenwell is the snowy section. I know now. Um, yes. Glenwell to the right, Mistum Far to the left. Mistum Far. Where did I hear that name? It was one. Of, it, it was through one of the cutscenes, I think, that we heard the name Mistenfar. Oh boy! I don't rip. Uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Find nothing of value. No. Yes, the snowball that I remember is, I think, in one of these trunks, I believe. Um. Oh boy. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Cassia leaves. Thank you, we need that. Um. Northern Pass. This is. This is Glenvale, I think? Or where Glenvale will be? Welcome to Miston Farm. May the goddess bless your travels. Welcome to Mistenfar, young one. Young Wilder. I think this is where you become a priestess. I think I don't remember. I think I don't remember. Hi. Welcome, sister. Bye. Hi. Welcome to Mistenfar. How are your travels? We're making progress. Welcome to Mistenfar. What is... Where will does test to become priestess or priest? Yes, this is it. After a young wielder like yourself ventures out into the world, they can align themselves with one of the magic orders. In our order, wielders learn the secrets of white magic. Would you like to join us, young wielder? No. Okay, so Mr. and Far. I, I I need to take notes quickly. So Mr. Mr. Far is where priestess class is. Um I think it was Witchwood Swamp where the witch class is. Not sure anymore. I'm definitely not going to change the class until the end game. I 
are studying. Are you going to join the order? There are lots of orders to choose from, silly. You can be priestess, witch, not mage. I've heard there are secret orders too. Like the pyromancer. Priestesses learn the art of healing magic. The sun priest has powerful order. Their influence stretched across all of them gave their lives in the middle to rid of all the order. Still questionable that fairies exist or have existed in the past. Many monsters have taken refuge from the world of man. Many of them claim that ha have been unfairly hunted for thousands of years. The elves live in the mystical land south of the mainland. It is said that the elves guard the oldest and largest library of the kingdoms. There are several orders that magic wielders can join. These orders, priestess, witch, may and mage are well known but other orders are said to exist dwarves live deep within the earth dwarves have a natural affinity for precious metals stones and moldy cheese dragons live near the core of the earth few who seek them ever return to the surface of the earth but if you are to defeat one of them you shall be granted the earth magic. We just learn how to hex things. Mages learn the art of earth magic. Priestesses learn the art of healing magic. Thank you for having so little to read there. <laughs> I do recall that <sighs> Priestess is a strong class change, doors locked. But it's glitched and you can easily die. Would you like to buy a holy pendant? I only have one left. But maybe later. I have a holy pendant already, so... This is Monster Hideout. Hi, the earth is unrestful lately. Monsters have, have been persecuted for thousands of years. By spreading peace and love, this stigma can be reversed. History of monsters and priestesses. The priestesses protect the monsters from the world. A great evil will enter the world and history will repeat. The dream guardian watches over the sleep of mortals. The guardian sleeps eternally, but if she wakes, the world will fall into nightmare. Succubus lives in a faraway land, deep within a water maze, where she stands guard over a relic of great power. Some monsters have rebelled, rebel, rebelled, rebelled against the humans and think they must be destroyed for peace to return to the world. We monsters think your prophecy is coming to pass, whether it is good or bad, we are not sure. Yeah, I think my complexion is rather big, becoming. <laughs> yeah. Welcome humans, don't be afraid, I won't hurt you, <laughs> not all monsters are bad. This is the only safe place for us anymore, humans have killed off most of our population. It's sad if you think about it. Oh, buy something! <laughs> Just look at that glitch! That graphical glitch! Two jacks, Jesus Christ. <laughs> Ice amulet. Ice sword. Warhammer. Ice sword is strong. Jar bombs. Eh, welcome to our humble kingdom, humans. Humble, humble, humble indeed. Not even a treasure chest. Unless I didn't notice.
I'm not sure. Is there a way to heal up here? I don't think there is. We has a problem then, guys, because I do not think we are able to <laughs> survive. Okay, we found Mistenfar. Firefly! Okay. We need to survive this. Oh, there's a chest I didn't even notice. Iron Staff. Thank you. That's so cool. <laughs> I love it. I think I have an Iron Staff already. No! Yes, I do. That's fine. I need to find that specific log. <laughs> I mean, I don't want to use the snowball already. I just want to have it. Let's quickly save the game. I think, I think, I think, nothing here. Oh boy. I think these are polar bears. One snow pendant. Yay. That's not what we want, but it's something. I also learned that someone began making a... Ooh, Mule Express, hi! Uh, someone began making a reboot to this game. Glenwell. The ice, I mean snow city. But sadly, it has been frozen in production. Are you a new miner? But I will uh, play the demo on the screen. I'm a miner. Then you should grow up first. <laughs> history of Glenwale. Little is known about the history of Glenwale. Except that the village is one of the oldest on the mainland. Ma mainland, it's the mainland! <laughs> List of things to do. Like, finish the demo. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you, thank you. We then. But first, we need to, we needs to see. Um, nothing. <clears throat> A hundred gold. Okay. Crooked. We need uh, this. We need uh, this. Wait. Oh. Weird. <laughs> you cannot go there. Okay. Um, was that a chest? 
No, just a graphical glitch. Vile of Tintura Ang. Hi. The winters are cold here, but I like the quiet life. It is good practice to leave the breadcrumb uh, a breadcrumb trail back to the surface when mining deep within the earth. Wow, strangers, do you like my snowman? No. <laughs> Barrel is sealed tightly. Let me try a loaf of bread. Hi, are you cold? Help yourself to hot soup on the table. Are you on your way to Mr. Var? <laughs> Let me eat the soup then. Guess not. Oh, thank you. Apparently, I could. Okay, this is a village market. I'm on my way to Mistelfar. This is a quaint mining town, don't you think? I'm the oldest. And once it was very mad. How times change. You search a barrel and find nothing. Uh, food items. Let's check all. Mutton, bread. That's okay. Ointments. Ice rain spell is what we would need. Okay, so Glenwell has ice rain spell. We need to remember that because I want to get it. No one appreciates the clown in this village. Iron staff, iron sword, plate armor. Ice sword. Sword made of ice. Let's sell the iron stuff. No, oh, that's barely anything. <sighs> oh, we don't need two bastard swords. Not like it's worth much. Doublets we can keep. Leather armor we don't need two of them. I mean, we can sell one doublet. We have stronger armors. Enough of them. Something of Anus. <laughs> Firefly Charm. Pelt the enemy with snow. Okay, this is what I found then. We did find it. Going mine in these days. Mountain animals being wishes. And this is nothing. Home sweet homie. Homie sweet homie. <laughs> okay, what's in here? Two aloe leaves. <clears throat> Since we did find everything we wanted, let's go to Kandar, Glenwell, Witchwood. No! Oh boy. They just use money. Okay. Thank god I saved. <laughs> I mean, I can go back without issue, not a big deal. I'm surprised that I found 10 amulets this time. I mean, I remember 5. 
So that means that last time I played the game several years back, I found only one of the... Okay. <laughs> Amulet spaces. Bye, Talia. Okay. Well, let's go this way then. Okay. This way is the Dwarven Mine. Dwarf Mines. What's the press for this? Excuse me? No one enters the forest mine for somebody pass for it. Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. I understand. So, you guys remember the dwarf who needs the cheese. We had a chance to get the cheese, but for some reason the game didn't want to allow us to get the cheese. Now, if we go back to the dwarf in the restaurant, we can request the password for the mines. But he is hungry, so he will not give us anything. But if we bring him the, the cheese that he requires, he will tell us the password. I wanted to check if the ball is over. Apparently it's not just yet. Okay, dude. What does the dwarf have to do? Could they get cheese? Now we should be able to get the cheese from the dwarf. From the other dude. Because now that we need the password, we can bribe the guy. I really need to start grinding off of these. <laughs> I think I'll do just that uh, later off screen. Dude, I need some cheesy. I study and courses and collect cheese on the side. Do I eat cheese? Do it as no, I hate the taste. You even collect stinky moldy cheese? Oh no, I throw it out once it gets moldy. What the fuck do you even get it for then? That cheese is not so moldy yet. Um, no. Can I get a cheese? Why you no give me cheese? Hmm. Okay, I guess the dwarf on mine can wait a bit. Then off we go to the apple orchard. But before we do that, we have a chest to collect uh, as well. Okay, that was weird. I cannot go down there and I cannot go up here. <laughs> RPG Maker. <laughs> Gotta love it. Okay, down here is the chest. Lightning Ring. And here's the apple orchard. Lila's apple orchard. Hi, Lila. Hello, dears. You look hungry. Have an apple. Ask about news. Apples, apples, apples. Thank you. Thank you. 
Now, can we actually get the apple? Okay. I think this girl is crazy. Not exactly sure. Um, well, she said take the apples, so I'll try taking some apples. Doesn't really work. Do I have apples? Nope. Not really sure what she meant there, but... Okay. Let's see if there are any chests hidden there, here and there. I don't even remember this place, all of a sudden. I mean, lore-wise, I love it because it adds to the world and makes it feel more alive. But I don't see the point of it. <laughs> okay. We are doing good. Let's find that in. How much was it? 30, okay. I say we are doing good. We are just half an hour in and we already did two more areas from which we also found a class change. So now we are going to go to Witchwood. And Duty Shrine, of course. Uh, but first, Witchwood. You travel for several hours. The grassy hills slope into damp, humid swampland. I don't like Witchwood. <clears throat> Mostly because everything is poisonous here. including the wizard enemies. But this is the sort of the best place to later get items. Bioventiquarium. As in, this is where you can dig up the running shoes, I believe. Which will help a bunch later. You just need the shovel, which is locked behind a side quest. I think this is where you're gonna... Maybe you should find the shovel. Uh, I think that's the... A uh, grave that will have the specific shoes. Not sure though. Um, also, it's kind of a maze.
that was weird. The position just reset like that. And we're poisoned, of course. Game, 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 chill. Don't need to lag. How about by Talia again? Charm Necklace. I believe Charm Necklace also works as a charm spell. That's which one down there, which is a place of witches, of course, the... and also where the witch class resides. You can stay the night here if you would like, the swamp is dangerous at night. Um, is this actually an inn? I believe so. Okay, good thing I served. <laughs> okay, girl? Heal, thank you. Um, hi, Broom. Mm. You warm your hands over the fire. Marsh tea leaf. Thank you, though. I mean, Witchwood is full of witches, but they are nice witches, so... This is a witch school. <laughs> Some charms protect against curses. Watch out for swamp hags outside the witchwood. They like to curse people. What happens if a person gets cursed? You get really weak. It's hard to defend yourself or fight when you're cursed. Only holy tonic can cure curses. Where do I find it? We've got a limited supply here in the tower. I've also heard there's a hermit in the north who sells it. AKA the... The guy with the moldy cheese. I like to get think of graves. I usually find interesting stuff. You should try it. Shh, I'm trying to listen. And that, students, is how you put wart on toads. I believe this chick is the one who teaches. You search shelves, but find nothing. You search, but find nothing. Hi! Hey, 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 I'm skipping class. You search wet but find nothing. You search wet but find nothing. This chick is the one who teaches it. You search through books but find nothing. Be sneaky so your victim cannot hex you back. Strong witches have the ability to turn their enemies into helpless frogs. If you're lost, your heckle, cackle, or evil giggle, eat a slice of heckle pie. It is best to get revenge before you have a need for revenge. <laughs> the Witching Order teaches its students how to hex and curse things. Swamp Witch is the most devious of all Witchwood. Strong curses will sap your powers and leave you defenseless. I believe it actually does, and you can see the stats. You search nothing, nothing. Nothing, 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 nothing. What's the point of all of these? Welcome to the Witchwood Travel Rose. What is this place? This is where wielders test to become witches or warlocks. Witch? 
After a young wielder like yourself watches art into the world, they can align themselves with one of the many magic orders. In our order, wielders learn the more interesting aspects of magic use. <laughs> Would you like to join us, young wielder? Now. <sighs> Which wood is the witch? Once I am finished with the game, I will probably make a ex exhibition video of all the stuff. Well, maybe if you didn't ride your broom, you would not be late for class. Wow. So, hi. I'm cleaning out the tower. If you see anything you want, please tell me. Goods. Nasty Aquiank Mahor. This the late Avanus. Holy Tonica. Serpent Dagger. Serpent Sword. Bone Rapier. Black Robe. We need a better dagger for Jack. So thank you. The Serpent Dagger, Serpent Sword, and Serpent Rapier can actually poison the enemy. Poison Ring and Charm Necklace. Okay. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Nothing, nothing. Ank Mahor. About time you got a new weapon. Okay, I'll be right back guys and we will continue. Welcome back guys. Let's continue doing this. Let's see, is there anything here? Nothing. Oh wait. I believe this is one of the side quests. Which is evil? Nah, except for the old bat who lives alone in the western swamp. She scares me. The old hag in the western swamp is the one who is the issue. That specific hag is the one who cursed something and uh, something is one of the side quests. Hi, you've met Daryl? That good for nothing warlock hexed me with an allure curse. I've been trying to lure him here for revenge. The guy who charmed us is the one who cursed this chick. I don't trust anything in this game anymore. The most weirdest thing could be a chest. Oh, sorry, a barrel. Have you come to train as a witch? We have bad stigma attached to our profession, but we're quite powerful. Maybe if some of your people didn't do stupid shit, then you wouldn't have bad reputation. Search, 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 search. Kitty cat, kitty cat, does not want to talk it back. Someone had been stealing broomsticks and toads from our apprentices. I really, aside from immersion, I really don't see the point of having all of this shit that you can respect and get nothing. Hi kitty cat. Wow wow. Welcome to Witchwood. Have you seen my magic room? I can't go to class without it. 
nothing. Ah, finally. Poison ring. Digging up graves with your fingernails will get you nowhere. You need a good shovel to get far. Maybe now the side quest for the shovel will appear. Maybe. Not sure though. I'll screw you too. Wild of Aquafolium. This is Broomstick Express. Welcome to Broomstick Express. Would you like to go to somewhere today? Okay, that will help us a bunch. Thank you for screwing me over. Oh no. We may be in trouble. Oh boy. Oh, bye, Devin. Your party has died. Now the question is, what is which way? I don't recall. And this is the docks, yes. Poison ring again. Oh boy. Really now? Bye again, kid. I think this leads to the... The West Swamp, I think. No, this is just a dead end. Because dead ends have to exist. Oh, this is a graveyard. Okay. This is where we can dig up some shit. <laughs> oh boy. Uh, mm -mm. I don't ex exactly remember which way is which, so... Es excuse my confusion. There we go. Some more HP. You travel east for several hours. You eventually leave behind the swampland and climb onto a plateau. 
Laden with seagrass? Oh, I remember this place. This is the place that I actually grind XP normally. This is my XP farming uh, zone, while the other space with the fairies is my money farming zone. I forgot about it. Okay, let's see what is here. Chest is locked. Lightning ring. Thank you for something I will probably never use. I mean, I might use it at the final boss. I don't exactly remember what else is here though. This is Seafall Shrine. I think we need to come this way. No. Water in our shrine is blessed by the goddess, has healing pro. This is why this is a good farming zone. Have you visited my system far? Welcome to Seafall. Have come far. Please drink. Grow strong. Yeah, thank you. Okay. Yeah, it doesn't feel completely. Which is a bit silly, but... Ah, boy. Don't go into the waterways, they are too dangerous. I believe we will be able to go there later, but not just yet. This is why this is so good for farming, because there's just a healing spot there exactly where it's most convenient. Fifty-two gold and twenty XP. And all you do is just go here. And we healed up and we can get continue farming. It's that easy. I mean, it's good for money as well because let's let's be honest, 50 gold is a lot right now. But it's not as good as the fairy zone which gives gemstones as drops and those gemstones can sell for a lot Let's see where did that specific staircase go there was a staircase here oh this is another section hi dude I'm thinking of moving to the city it's too quiet out here Marsh tea. Juneberry branches. And it's 750 gold pennies. Nice. And to the right is you don't have a reason to visit the dock. All oh, right. This dude gives us his ship. Okay. I believe he gives us a ship. And that's why it's saying that we don't have reason to go to the docks because his ship is stationed there. Well, there we go. Uh, let's go and heal up quick. The only real drawback to this healing fountain is the fact that it doesn't heal MP, only HP. But it's good. 
I like how our movement is the same as the flight speed of the bird. <laughs> Let's see, uh, we still have the OT Shrine to do, uh, but I believe we are gonna stop here for today. Clearly I need to grind a bit, because, oh boy, this is not working out much. Uh, So we're gonna stop here for today and tomorrow we're gonna continue and go directly to the DOT shrine where our main quest is waiting for us. Uh, we have done all the side quests and stuff that uh, that we can generally do right now. The only thing that may be left is the broom quest in Kandar, which I think we will start with that next episode. And after that go to a duty shrine. But for now we will stop here and I'll begin farming a little bit off screen. Because let's be honest, we need that XP. We seriously need that XP and this will take a while. <clears throat> So, until tomorrow, thank you everyone for watching. Uh, look forward to more episodes of Airman's Prophecy. And once uh, this series is over, look forward to the exhibitions and the video on the reboot demo. Until then, be blazing, friends. Bye-bye.